What is going on, ladies and gentlemen? My name is Mr. Levi, and welcome to another trailer. Let's get my head fully in frame there, shall we? Don't want none of that business. Uh, today, I'm here with Digimon Story Cyber Sleuth. Um, I'm a little late to the game. I have a full-time job. I'm sorry. I can't just do this all day long, and I have other obligations, like Dungeons & Dragons. It's more important, trust me. <laughs> but... Uh, I don't know if you guys ever watched Digimon growing up, but I will smack my pop filter with my headphones because I keep this mic too damn close to my face. I don't know if you guys ever watched Digimon growing up, but I did. And it rivaled Pokemon oh so hard that I actually enjoyed Digimon more than I enjoyed Pokemon, but Digimon kind of died. It didn't die. It kind of died. It went into coma. And it's back, baby. 2019 is a great year for video games, and I'm so excited about this because here we are with, you know, Digimon Story Cyber Sleuth, where you essentially in Digimon, if you guys don't know, you, you get sucked into, or the kids get sucked into a video game, essentially. Essentially. It's a digital world. And they fuck shit up. It's not quite like Monster Rancher where they actually get sucked into a video game. But here we are. We're going to watch this. We got blood, crude humor, fantasy, violence, language, and suggestive themes. So all good things for teenagers. Log into a world filled with mysteries and adventure. Digimon Story Cyber Sleuth Complete Edition is a two-in-one game that includes both Cyber Sleuth and Hacker's Memory. It is set in the near future where users could physically enter a cyberspace world known as Eden. Dis Hacker's Memory? Ooh, that's Discover gonna be a struggle up for me to do again. Along the way, and experience the intertwining of the virtual and real worlds. Welcome to Eden. It's an advanced Eden. form of the internet where users could physically enter virtual reality. Here in this utopia, there are rules and laws for crime prevention, but the cunning still lurks about. Hackers roam the virtual space and use specialized AI programs known as Digimon. Digimon! Let's take a peek at the two titles that come in Digimon Story Cyber Sleuth Complete Edition. A strange yes, please, encounter with a mysterious figure leads that got you to really becoming loud. a half-digital being. Jesus. Identify half allies being? to help unravel the clues between the real world and the virtual world in your newfound form. With the interest of recovering your physical body, embark on an adventure to discover the countless amount of Digimon. Collect and raise them as companions to engage Ooh. against enemies in strategic turn-based combat. Love RPGs. Having his Eden account stolen, Keisuke Amasawa is framed for a crime he didn't commit. Play as Keisuke as you venture in and out of the virtual space to prove his innocence. Become a cohort for a team named Hoodie to gain the proper okay. hacking skills to finally track down the culprit responsible for framing him. Grab I mean, your this all copy sounds of pretty Digimon awesome. Story Cyber Sleuth Complete Edition for the Nintendo Switch I'm and PC be honest, I'm on not October too worried about 18th, the story. 2019. Yeah, I'm more worried about just the gameplay. Stop. Stop with your Rainbow Six Siege. All right, rainbow6.com slash sale. I might have to look into that. But no, guys. Tell me, what do, what do you guys think? Let's let's get this off the screen here. Let's let's get this ad out of here. Re reload. Go away. No ads. YouTube premium. No YouTube Try premium. Go away. We don't want your ads. Okay. So what's it say here? Digimon Cyber. Digimon Story Cyber Sleuth. Complete edition includes two complete stories filled with mystery and adventure. Check out the newest trailer for details on what both tales have to offer when it launches on October 18th for the Nintendo Switch and PC. Something on the Switch that I can finally get, even though, you know, I don't really have a Switch. So, I don't know if you guys have ever played any other Digimon game, but they're amazing. They're always RPGs, essentially, because... Oh my god, Josh, quit texting me 50 freaking messages at once. Just type out the whole thing. Um... But they're always like RPGs. Uh, my favorite was the one for the GameCube where you actually played as the monsters. So this one, it seems like you're playing as two separate people raising Digimon like the show is. And I'm pretty excited because Digi Evolution was amazing. 
So essentially, what the digital the digivolution digi digi evolution. I'm just gonna call it yeah digi evolution. I think is what they always just called it. They didn't try to shorten it too much because it sounds weird. But digi evolution is amazing because they bump up the different levels and different tiers, but then they revert back and then they bump up and eventually unlock. So they kind of go super saiyan and then go back down and then like okay we need to be stronger. So we managed to break through our power level and now we're super saiyan three, but it's so much better than that. So. It kind of, in that sense, I like it more than Pokemon. But I'm really excited for these RPGs. Um, it's been a while since I've seen a Digimon game. I hope Digimon makes a little bit more of a comeback. Uh, it'd be amazing. But uh, let's see what we can find out about this game, shall we? All right, so I'm on the main page. And it doesn't really tell us anything all too different than what we already knew. With engaging storyline, classic turn-based battles, sends a Digimon to collect. Uh, it comes with both Cyber Sleuth and Cyber Sleuth Hacker's Memories. Get the full experience with the complete edition, which includes both titles in one. And if you click over here on the features, it's become, uh, become a cyber detective or a powerful hacker to solve diabolic, bio, blah, 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 blah. diabolical digi mysteries. Um, embark on a thrilling adventure where the lines between the real and digital world are blurred. More than 300 Digimon to raise, collect, and digivolve. So, and then uh, build an all-star all -star team to make, take on opponents in classic turn-based battles. So that right there, definitely, I don't know why this sentence right here, but makes me think that there's probably gonna be some online PVP. Uh, that would be cool if that was implemented, especially now that they have, you know, it's really simple to do that kind of stuff. And with turn-based RPGs, it's really not hard to do that. But at the same time, I don't think it will. Um, I don't know, I could be wrong. I don't wanna go to your store, go away. But tell me what you guys think. Tell me what you uh, think, uh, you know, what your ideas, your thoughts on this. Also, do you prefer Pokemon or do you prefer Digimon? That was always a thing for me growing up was, you know, which one did you prefer? For me, it was Digimon, but I love Pokemon. I love them both. And Pokemon took off way better. It was way more widely accepted, clearly. Uh, we're on like over 800 Pokemon. We're on our eighth main game and there's loads of branches, like branch offs. But Digimon never really died. It always managed to come back. But uh, I think that's going to be it for me, guys. Let me know what you think. I definitely can't wait to play it. It looks pretty intense. It looks pretty clean. Uh, the animation, the artwork on it was all good. I saw no negatives. I saw nothing that made it look like the gameplay was going to be garbage. Uh, you run around as a person. It looked like your Digimon followed you around from what, it, what I could understand. Um, so it definitely looks clean. But I think that's going to be it for me, guys. Thank you so much for watching. As always, I appreciate it. I will see you guys next time. If you're new to the channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the bell icon next to you, guys. And don't forget to hit that like button if you liked the video. And the dislike button if you disliked it. But, you know, let me know what you disliked if you did so I can try to improve. Thanks, guys. Bye.